Well, new at six tonight, an area in our valley that's seen some of the worst flooding in Las Vegas is no longer in a danger zone. The houses didn't change, but a lot of the land around them did. 13 Action News anchor Leslie Maureen joins us live near the Desert Rose Golf Course with more on this change tonight. Leslie. Trisha, this neighborhood right here behind me was one of the worst hit back in 2012. This RV here doesn't even run anymore. That's because water came way past the tires nearly to right here. Things today much different as we're told these homes now out of the flood zone. Doug Brokaw remembers the day his neighborhood went underwater. I was chest I have pictures of guys walking through the water. In 2012, the Las Vegas wash saw some of the worst flooding. One man even killed by the swift water. The water came basically up to the basically where my bumper is. But today things are drier ever since the county completed a $58 million renovation. The wash is now able to retain more water. Like the highest that we've seen it maybe like six feet below that bridge. The best part, the savings. 1400 homes in the flood area can do away with the once mandated flood insurance. You don't have to purchase flood insurance anymore. So your cost goes from 1700 to zero, essentially. It goes down there. Leo Villasenor pays nearly $1,200 a year to protect his dream home. It's exciting to know that my payment is going to be dropped down significantly, mm -hmm. but I still think that we're going to go for you know, a minimal amount of coverage. Despite the wash passing the test each time it rains, many homeowners say they weren't expecting the floods in 2012, so they're skeptical of the future. It's just a wait and see. And in fact, every time it rains, I call home and say, is it flooding yet? And the regional flood control district tells us they are continuing work down to washes on Nellis and Stewart. They hope to get 300 more homes out of the flood zone. Reporting live, Leslie Marine 13 Action News.